<clears throat> so come on in. Take a sip. Let's wind down on the Monday grid. Uh, and today we're doing it with a Domina Franken. And it is as delightful as you can possibly imagine. Uh, very much all, very much about the black stone fruits and and very rich in the cassis. And you talk about just being a deep, deep ruby red. There is no catching the time or anything through this thing. This, this is a nice, beautiful, on the nose. And it finishes even better. So wholeheartedly recommend. So let's see. Let's pull up our grid and see what we've got today. So we got a construction by Jeffrey Lees. Yay. Edited by Joel Faliano. Yay. All right. So United States Public Health Org. Oh, what do we have? We've got, uh, got a lot of them, right? So, I mean, just think maybe CDC to start with. Maybe just see what we got. Could be the FDA for all I know. Gives the heebie-jeebies without, maybe creeps out, perhaps. Spanish for money, dinero. Okay, well now I know that we are solid on our CDC. Where beers can be found at a tailgate party. And I honestly don't think I've ever been to a tailgate party. Ever. I'm missing out. I bet this is a cooler. Cry from someone who has finally had it. Well, clearly, we have an ENO here to start. So what do you think? Enough already? It would be two. It would be one letter too short for enough already. Isn't that weird? How so many years of doing crosswords, you can just see if something will fit in there without actually counting them out. It's just bizarre to me. Still, I don't know. How about enough is enough? And we'll promptly check ourselves to make sure that we're not getting down the wrong track. But, I mean, wriggly sea creatures definitely got to be eels, right? Fuss over one's appearance. I might have been accused of preening on occasion. Uh, login requirement. How about a user ID? So we got, like, typical Monday fare thus far. Implore, maybe to beg. I'm feeling better already about enough is enough. Tennis champ Arthur Ashe. I have Arthur Ashe personalized plates here in Germany, commemorating his 297th win. I mean, no, they just came that way, Ashe, and then, you know. Monday Night Football Channel, how about ESPN? Police procedural that premiered in 2003. I just don't care for police shows, but I know this has got to be NCIS, right? Um... I mean, it's either that, if it's in three letters, you know, you're going to get the CSI. And if it's five letters, you're going to have CSI and then whatever two-letter code is for, you know, whatever city they're in. we got like a million of them out now, apparently. So impressively done as a job. Um, is this a G? Oh, no. It could be a gasp. Yes. Yeah, so getting moving beyond our, cl our, our pearl-clutching moment here, our gasps, we can say this is probably a bang-up job. So nice. Something brought out with a restaurant check. Maybe the pen. Break free. Escape. Okay. Flips on its head. Maybe upends. It's in my blank. I was made for this. Going for DNA and nibble between meals. Maybe to nosh. <clears throat> Missouri's Ozark Mountains. <clears throat> interesting choice most of the time you hear the arkansas's ozark mountains so nice mount olympus ruler the mighty zeus audibly reacts to fireworks me think ooze or oz to and fro maybe so i'm gonna go with the ooze chimney duck could be a flu language that's mutually intelligible with thai and that would be lao I know very little, but it's a cool language. So sarcastic non-apology looks like it's going to work out to be maybe sorry, not sorry. One of those non-apology apologies. I'm sorry you were hurt by my otherwise normal statement that wasn't in any way whatsoever intending to hurt you. Snowflake, you know, that kind of thing. 
home of MoMA for sure. And the Shotzi sitting behind me here owes me a trip to New York at some point. My sister owes me a trip to Peru. All right, the Veni in Veni Vidivici, and this is I Came, followed by I Saw and I Kicked Butt, Conquered, Heavens, maybe Skies. It's a weird, that's a weird clue answer combo, isn't it? Heavens, Skies. I mean, I probably would have put like Blue Blank, Smiling at Me, you know, hit for Willie Nelson in 1976 or something, right? Like blue Skies, something, anything. Heavens to Betsy. Relaxing getaway. How about a spa day? Drain, maybe zap. Now we can check that uh, Z pretty easily. Contest of Continental Conquest. And so that would be Risk then, the board game. 2024, for example, about a year maybe. Pod and a vegetable. Pod vegetable in gumbo. Okay, so okra. I don't, I don't, can't do okra. Comic Silverman, Sarah. And Apollo Mission Org. Yes, it's true, but it's also the Artemis, his sister, Mission Org. Musket Residents or Omanis. I was there very briefly once. I remember it being very hot. Mother with a Nobel Peace Prize, and it would be Teresa. Any member of NATO to another. How about an ally? A religion of the Quran, Islam. Which means what? Submit. Actress de Armas. And I think, is that Anne? I can't ever remember Anne. Um, let's see. Pain relief, brand is Anna. So we're talking about a leave then, because what else are you going to put in there with five spaces? Popular brunch order, maybe an omelet. Recapped a frustrating day at work, maybe vented. That's what our other halves are there for, isn't it? To listen to us vent. Perennial optimist motto. Well, I think we can go ahead and just fill this out completely. I think this is never say never, right? So I just love it when they help you fill in the grid space. Overnight flight, maybe a red eye. Agent blank. Scully of the X-Files. I don't know. I have no idea. No idea. Don't know anything about it. Kane's brother in Genesis. I think we'll go for Abel. And NASDAQ Alternative, probably the NYSC. Landed on maybe a lit. So I guess that's Dana Scully. I guess I should probably, or Agent Dana Scully of the X-Files. I probably should commit that to memory. And the other one's Mulder or something, right? I don't know what his first name is or if he's the he or which one's which. Because Dana is a unisex name. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I imagine that's the part that's played by... Uh, what's her name? Is it Jillian Anderson or something? But Fury. How about Fire? Fire. And I just woke up S I R I with that one. Turn her off. Way to make incremental progress. I'm going to go with little by little. If you're just starting out crosswording, if you're just starting your solving journey in life, start with this Monday. This is a good one to start with. Evolve over time. That certainly works for me. State that's home to Rehoboth Beach, and I guess that's Delaware. Uh, close again as an envelope, maybe to reseal. Did I fat finger anything? And sorry about the yesterday's puzzle, by the way. If I had technical difficulties, I just said, screw it, I'm taking a day off. And I apologize for that. I'm very sorry about it. Uh, if anybody was looking forward to that, I'm, in, I'm terribly sorry. Last thing you want to do is upset your your base. Chunk of concrete. You want to go with a slab on this one? I say we go with a slab. Quick drive around town. Sounds like a Bruce Springsteen song. Euro bread. Interesting. I for four letters. I immediately thought euro because you know. Greek is part you know, the Greece is part of the European Union. I was thinking, oh bread, but no, actually literally they want pita. It's the pita. 
Polished off, maybe eight. Tabloid couple, an item. Shotzi and I stay out of the tabloids. We have a technique for that. It's called not being famous. Sheep, flock, cow, maybe herd. And alas, poor Yorick. I knew him. Hamlet. Shakespeare majors unite. We know poor Yorick. <laughs> My favorite line from Shakespeare's Hamlet is when Hamlet looks over and he says, what? I haven't memorized it. I haven't memorized. Wedding ceremony words. I do. Or the end of bachelorhood. Biblical land west of Nod. It looks like we got Eden there. An actor's assignment looks like a role. And what do we got here? A fracas, maybe a melee. Colleague, maybe a peer. And if I hope I didn't fat finger anything. And bards before air. Then say, how do we do, Bob? Well, I guess, you know, it is what it is. May have been maybe a four minute solve if I had kept my mouth shut and just concentrated on it. But then again, that would be very boring, wouldn't it? So, um, yeah, not a ton of, uh, of uh, interesting fill here. And then not just like, just, it wasn't just a whole heck of a lot of clever going on either. But it's a solid Monday grid. It had a nice gait. Um, well, almost a gator, really, right? You know, and um, I, yeah, if you're just starting or if you know someone who's interested in just starting the solving journey, Shoot them a link to this puzzle. It would be a great way to start. So let's go ahead and flick you out of here until tomorrow. And I want to say uh, thank you again for subscribing and liking and comments. They, I mean, nothing makes my day more. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that very much. Uh, we will be going on vacation starting Friday. Um, and uh, and we'll be gone for about a week and a half or so, I guess. But uh, if the if the internet's good on the Virgin Cruise, um, then we'll be uploading. If not, probably just uh, yeah, probably just have to post stuff in the uh, public community center uh, section there, right? So, uh, but nevertheless, I'm gonna hate taking that long a, a leave of absence here from my favorite thing in the world to do, which is to do the puzzle with you. So, hopefully, we will have solid internet access as we uh, cruise down through uh, France and Spain and so on um until uh the next time um ich wünsche ihnen einen schönen tag noch danke danke schön dass du hier bist einen schönen tag einen schönen abend auch tschüss servus grüß gott auf wiedersehen ciao chin chin see you later bis morgen bis morgen bis später tschüss <laughs>